We now know the identity of a man who was shot to death early this morning in the East Hills. The medical examiner has identified him as 20-year-old Ricky Moultrie. As Amy Wattis reports, the search continues this afternoon for the person who shot him. Police found that man a shot to death inside of a car here on Lee Way. He was found with a gunshot wound to the head. This is the car police found that man in, a gray Nissan being towed away from the crime scene. Joe Barnett lives nearby. That upsets me highly because this is probably one of the nicest neighborhoods I know of. It's so quiet back here. Everybody knows everybody. Police found the man in the car just before three this morning. He was pronounced dead at the scene. I was wondering what was going on. So much commotion. I thought it was a wreck up on Robinson Boulevard as usual. Rick Dennis came to the area from Baltimore and has lived here for about 15 years. He thinks crime has gotten worse over time. The killings are becoming more frequent now. He says it's a popular area for through traffic. I'm a dog walker. I see them parked around here selling drugs and what have you. And uh, that's just how it is. It's just too close to home. I got to get away from here. I'm going to sell out. It has changed. The intersection of Sunrise Avenue at Lee Way was closed for hours as police gathered evidence in their search for the shooter. As far as a motive, that's unclear. Amy Wattis, KDKA News.